Hello everyone, here is your weekend watch list. First up, the big cinema premiere this weekend is definitely Baz Luhrmann's Elvis, which looks like it's going to be, how do I put this, a lot, everything. Jumpsuits and jewels, gyrating, young Elvis, later Elvis. We've got Austin Butler playing the titular role, uh, Tom Hanks playing the deeply problematic Colonel Tom Parker. We're reviewing this next week on Popcorn Culture, so we will see. Are you ready to fly? I'm ready. Ready to fly. Anyway, speaking of the big screen, here is a PSA that if you haven't seen Top Gun Maverick yet, I'm not sure how much longer it's actually going to be on the biggest screens, which is really where you should catch it. So if you've been thinking of watching or re-watching on IMAX, this weekend might be good. On to what you can catch at home. Some new stuff on Netflix. Uh, season 3 of The Umbrella Academy is out, which sees the siblings we know thrust into a different timeline, meeting the kids of the Sparrow Academy. Uh, we've also got Money Heist Career, Joint Economic Area, Area, which is all about thieves trying to get into the mint of a unified career. Sounds pretty interesting, getting pretty good reviews. For something much lighter, Rowan Atkinson is returning to silent comedy in Man vs. Bee, which is exactly what it sounds like. It's a homeless guy who finds himself being a house sitter, trying to do his job, pursuit, hire bee. Do you have anything to say before you're taken down? You see? There was this big. Finally, just quickly, some stuff to catch up on on Disney Plus. Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness just dropped, and if you need to watch Wonder Vision to get all caught up, you know where that is as well. Um, and then Obi Wan Kenobi just finished up, uh, and now is a good time to catch all six episodes. We're also reviewing that next week on Popcorn Culture. <laughs> That is it. Um, what are you watching this weekend? Let us know. 